the grade one were inspired to learn more about the Calgary Zoo's whooping crane conservation program. We developed a love for these elegant and beautiful birds. We want to share the research that made us that we did that made us aware of how these graceful animals have been bought, brought back from the brink of extinction. We hope you come to understand how all of us can restore the whooping cranes. What one time task. have long legs and a long neck. I have a red spot on the top of my head. My bill is long and has some yellow on it. When I was a baby, my eyes were blue and now they are yellow. I have left feathers and black on the end of my wings. I live in Alberta in Royal Forest Wetlands. I live in Wood Buffalo National Park where whooping cranes are protected. I like wetland joy ponds with tall grasses, cattails, and vegetation. In the winter, I migrate to Texas. I am an omnivore and like to eat plants and small animals. In Canada, we eat snails, minnows, insects, and snakes. When I am migrating, I eat grains from fields. And when I get to the Gulf Coast, I like to eat crabs and clams. A mate by doing a dance and make a sound. I lay two large eggs in the spring and it takes 29 days for the eggs to hatch. My baby took out one orange. We are endangered in 1940. There were only 21 of us left in the world. We have been hunted and our habitat been taken by humans. Sometimes they disturb our nests and eggs. Then our babies don't hatch and that is why we became endangered. Thanks to the Calgary Zoo and scientists, there are now about 800 of us in the world in the world you now. can save us by protecting our wetland habitats you can take action and help wildlife be safe in our habitats too we love whooping cranes